So uh, I've been working on designing contact lenses for treating ophthalmic diseases for a long time. And I, the first uh, disease that we were interested in was glaucoma. So we're working on that, we're publishing on that. So one day we received this very encouraging email from Anne-Marie uh, from Cystinosis Island telling us that there is a disease called cystinosis that seems uh, uh, to be very relevant to what we are doing. And she wanted to discuss the possibility of us using our contact lenses for treating cystinosis. Uh, so that's how we got involved. So, uh, you know, I mean, after we heard about the disease, uh, because it's an orphan disease, so frankly, not too many people know about it. And that was actually one of our motivations for getting into it, uh, because that gives us an opportunity to learn about something that is new, but at the same time, it's very impactful. And also be communicated to the rest of the community. So when I go to conferences, I present on cystinosis, people get very really excited because people learn, like to learn new things. Uh, so really what we are doing is designing contact lenses for treating ophthalmic diseases. And the reason why it is so very useful for cystinosis patients is because I'm sure all of you are familiar with uh, the fact that patients have to deliver multiple eye drops every day. Uh, maybe sometimes eight, depending on the formulation. And if you're using viscous formulation, as many as four. Now, I have a kid who is 11 years old and I have trouble getting him to brush every night. So I can't even imagine how difficult it must be to put eye drops in the eye every hour, especially in very, very young children. So that really got me just, uh, uh, you know, really interested in it to see how can we do something uh, that will be good for our research, but would also have tremendous impact and really improve the quality of life of people. So our goal right now is to replace those eight eye drops with a single contact lens. Uh, you, the patients uh, or their uh, the parents will put the lens in themselves or in the in their children in the morning and the lens will stay in the eye for eight hours and when you're about ready to go to sleep you will take it off and it would have accomplished the same job or actually better than what those hourly eye drops would. And the great thing is that if, uh, if you also need to correct your vision then with that contact lens you can correct the vision while still deliver the drug and so you can achieve the twin benefits. Frankly, I do think that cystinosis Ireland bats way higher than what the population of Ireland would suggest. Uh, so uh, I've been fortunate to work with them and they're, I think they're a group of amazing people, extremely committed to what they're doing, uh, extremely good at understanding the nuances of research while balancing it with the needs of the community. So yeah, I think I love working with them and, uh, and, and, and frankly, I think I couldn't have gotten where we have with our, with our, uh, with our research without health assistance as I did.